Introduction Hi friends, you must have seen the mountains, soil in the yard and sand on the road. You also must have collected some stones. Do you know what are they made up of? They are different forms of rocks. Let us discuss about different kinds of rocks. Objectives At the end of this course, you will be able to Describe rocks and their types Explain soil and soil erosion Discuss about the minerals Explain the importance of Chipko movement and Van Mahotsa. As we can see that rocks are all around us. We can also see different things made up of rocks inside our house, in our yard, on the road and everywhere. Do you know statues, chalk, marble, pencil head, mountains and soil are all different forms of rocks? You will be surprised to know that rocks aren't always huge solids. Sand and mud are also forms of rocks. All rocks come from earth and all the three layers of earth are made up of rocks. So we can say that rocks are formed inside the earth. The outermost layer of the earth is called crust, which is formed by solid rocks and soil. The middle and innermost layers are known as mantle and the core respectively. Mantle and outer core is very hot due to high temperature, so rocks are found beneath in melted form. In the inner core, rocks are solid due to high pressure. Dear friends, there are three main types of rocks depending on how they are formed. These are Igneous rocks, sedimentary rocks, and metamorphic rocks. Let's discuss about them in detail. Igneous rock is formed when molten rocks like lava in volcanoes cool and get hardened, solidified. It is often shiny and glossy. Basalt, granite, pumice, and quartz are the examples of this kind of rock. Now let's discuss about sedimentary rock. Water and air break igneous rocks into smaller rocks, consequently soil is formed. These pieces settle into layers. Then these layers get compressed and hardened and finally become sedimentary rock. Sedimentary rock is usually soft to touch. Limestone, chalk, and coal are the examples of this kind of rocks. Now we come on to metamorphic rock. It is formed either from igneous or sedimentary rock. Igneous or sedimentary rocks are changed or get modified into metamorphic rock due to the influence of heat and pressure. This process occurs deep inside the earth. Metamorphic rock is usually hard and often contains crystals. Marble and slate are the examples of this kind of rocks. Now let's shift to minerals. Minerals are the materials from which rocks are formed. Minerals contain several important substances. Some minerals contain metals like gold and copper and are called as ores. We get metals from these ores. Now we move on to another interesting topic of this course, that is soil. Soil is a thin layer of earth's crust. It is formed by breaking of rocks into small pieces by the influence of water or wind. Soils are of different types, such as red soil, black soil, coarse soil and fine soil. Mineral Water and air are the three important components of soil. Do you know what soil erosion is? Sometimes the soil is carried away by wind and water. This is called soil erosion. You will be surprised to know that cutting of trees also cause soil erosion. 
Soil erosion makes it infertile. We can protect soil erosion by planting more and more trees. Now we know about an event related to protection against the cutting of trees. The Chipko movement or Chipko Andolan, literally to stick in Hindi, is a social ecological movement through the act of hugging trees to protect them from being felled. Friends, now let's know about Van Mahotsav. Van Mahotsav is a tree planting festival celebrated in the month of July every year. We celebrate Van Mahotsav too. Increase production of fruits and productivity of agricultural fields. Provide fodder leaves for cattle. Conserve soil and to increase the fertility of the soil. Generate love and awareness of uses of trees among the people. Summary Now friends, let us summarize what we have learned. Rocks are all around us. All rocks come from earth. Rocks are of mainly three types. Igneous, sedimentary and metamorphic rock. Rocks are formed of minerals. Soil is a thin layer of earth's crust. Carrying away of soil by wind and water is called soil erosion. To protect the trees from falling down, people hugged them and this movement is known as Chipko movement. Van Mahotsab is a tree planting festival that develops love and awareness of uses of trees among the people.